Memorial Day is fast approaching. Of course, a lot of you are probably thinking about grilling or barbecuing outside, but you don't want to do it until you hear what this guy has to say because he's the master when it comes to that. Sterling Smith, owner of Luton Booty Barbecue. Thank you so much for joining us. It's Thank good to you. see you. It's good to see you. Thank you for having us. Well, today. let's talk about why you're the master because you are an internationally award winning champion competition barbecue cook. And I don't say that lightly because take a look. He brought the award. That's it. You got it. You know, uh, it's just a lot of time and energy that we put into it. We've mm -hmm. been in our 10th year yes. of competition barbecue. So it's been leading up to, you know, uh, doing everything right and the, and the right way to do it in the process. And well, let's, that. let's talk about how we do it right because a lot of people as I mentioned they're going to be grilling and barbecuing for Memorial Day but they want to take it beyond just hot dogs and, and burgers you know what is the secret because you have this line of rubs and sauces yes. is it all in the sauce actually you know the, the products do help you but barbecue is, is cooking in general you know mm -hmm. it's attention to detail you want to make sure you start out with the best quality meat possible if you start out with the best quality product your end results going to be quite quality as long as you put in that time and the energy to make it right. right. So it's really about the process and the, and the technique of doing it. Uh, rubs and sauces help enhance that. Smoke help enhances the, the flavor of mm -hmm. the uh, meat. So it is a combination of everything. It's not, I don't think there's really a secret. The secret is doing it right. And the having secret love is the process. And process and the attention to yes. detail. That's definitely love, the secret. Love, a lot of love. A lot of love, man. We cook everything with love because <laughs> we're feeding our families. That's yeah. what it's about and family is love and we want to share that with our families. Well, I'm excited that I'm your family today. Well, you're so so talk to me about how important it is to prep the meat. You know, preparation is very important, especially in competition barbecue. We have an end result that we're trying to reach. Mm -hmm. So every step up to that end result, we have to make sure that we are keeping organization. It's a process, and if anything's messed up in that in that timeline, we need to make sure we fix it before we get to the end. Okay. So it's all so about the technique. Can you demonstrate that for us? Absolutely. With in this competition piece barbecues, of meat? this is a baby back rack of ribs. It mm -hmm. comes off the back of a uh, of a pig, not of a baby pig. They call it baby because of the weight. Uh, so it's really nice in here. When we're in competition barbecue, we really look for these straight bones that are running up and down. It's going to give the judges a good bite. Okay. We look for marbling, all that fat. That that's running through the meat. We really want the fat that's inside the meat. That's mm -hmm. going to help flavor and keep everything moist. The fat on the outside will get rid of a lot of that when we when we cook because that's just going to render. It's going to end up in the bottom of our smoker and it's going to end up a job for us. Okay. So really what we want to do is do a light seasoning on this. Sometimes there's a membrane that we'll remove. Okay. So uh, it's really a and light And what is coating. this you're using on This it? is my Luton Booty Barbecue Everything Rub. Okay. It is really made for pork, but we formulated it to work on everything. Mm -hmm. We use it in guacamole. I use it on beef. I use it on chicken. We use I it in love it. Everything. Vegetables that. as well. <laughs> uh, they have won many awards to the National Barbecue Association Conference. So really what this, when you're seasoning the meat, you really don't want to do too much. It's mm -hmm. really a light coat. You want everything to be a balance. The balance with the meat, balance with the seasonings, the salts, the sugars, Keep a steady the hand. smoke. It's <laughs> back and forth. <laughs> you know? And you don't really want this clumpy and coaty because clumpy and coaty is going to stop mm -hmm. the bark from forming and that nice bark that you see on the right. outside here, we really want that crust. Okay, so then what's the next step? After this, I like to let this seasoning sit in. We want this to sit in for about 30 minutes. Okay. It allows the meat to sweat. And when it sweats, all the moisture is going to come up. It's going to accept the salts, the sugars, the flavors. It's going to bring it back down into mm -hmm. the meat. It's going to help keep it moist. So you really want those seasonings to set in 30 minutes, 45 minutes, sometimes an hour. Usually what we're going to do on the sauces, we're going to use those at the end. Usually sauces have a high sugar content. You know, that gets a nice sweet flavor to it. So really on the sugars, if you're using any of those sugars at the end, you want to do it at the end so it doesn't burn. Okay, so real quickly, I want people to know that you also have these barbecue classes. Absolutely. I have uh, I just got, I had a class here in Scottsdale two weeks ago mm -hmm. at Barbecue Island with mm -hmm. Green Mountain Grills, which is a pellet smoker company. I uh, was in Texas last weekend, and this weekend I'll be in Winter Garden, Florida. He uh, travels a lot. Uh, it's, it's a great <laughs> time. I, I love traveling. I love spreading not just, you know, my food, but telling people how to achieve right. these great results in their backyard, and we can do that with Green Mountain Grills. Okay, real awesome quickly, I want you to mention this. Uh, this is the front of the book. Whoops, it's called Arizona and now I just lost the page. No problem. Ah. Arizona Wear Magazine. Uh, this is going to be at a... There it is. Uh, there there it, is. it is. It's, the, it's uh, I was featured in Wear Magazine. It's a Wear Guest Book actually and it's going to be at uh, local Arizona resorts, mm. hotels and it's amazing. So excited for you. I'm tasting the meat. It's delicious. Thank you so much for being here. Um, stay tuned because you're going to find out where you can eat some of this food in person very, very soon. But in the meantime, just get in those barbecue classes. Absolutely. That's the best way to taste it. It's well worth it. Thank you for Perfect. being here. Thank you. And By the way, lootandbootybarbecue.com. Check them out.